Welcome to the Bentley Systems Training Course, where you will learn how to specify analysis criteria and assign properties in the RAM frame analysis mode. For this particular video, we are going to show you how to incorporate your second order effects into your analysis. To start that process, I will select the criteria option from the menu bar and then select general. Here I'm going to take a look at the P delta effects. Now these are the second order effects induced on a structure due to the movement of its mass under lateral loads. Here you can see you have the option to either include or ignore the P delta effects. In the general criteria dialog, I'm going to ensure that the yes radio button is selected to include the P large delta effects in the analysis. You can see that when P delta effects are included, you can include them by using either your mass loads or your gravity loads. Now the use mass loads option uses your building masses to calculate your P delta effects. Alternatively, you could also use your gravity loads. This option will use the applied dead load, live load, roof and snow loads to calculate your P delta effects. You're going to notice that there are different scale factors that can be defined for each of those different load types. In either case, the program applies the same method to calculate your P delta effects. The only difference is that the former uses building masses converted to building weights to be used in your P delta calculations and the latter uses dead load and live load instead for the P delta effects. It should also be noted that P delta effects are not only considered for rigid diaphragms, but they'll also be included for analysis with semi-rigid diaphragms. The last thing I want to mention is that you should ensure that your scale factors do correspond to your building code requirements and the design method you are utilizing throughout your steel design, whether it's ASD or LRFD. At this point, let's go ahead and click OK. And whenever we perform our analysis, we can be assured that our P large delta effects will be considered. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you and see you next time.